Hey guys, this is uh, BNSF 896 Texas. Um, haven't made a video, haven't posted a video in a while. Been real busy with work. Real busy, out of town a lot. But um, here's the beginning of my new HO gauge. Was O gauge, now I'm HO. This is the beginning of uh, Melville, Texas. This is a BNSF engine yard facility. Coming in right in here. Got my engine house, three door on that side, repair facility. And it breaks down on this other side of the switch over here. That's going to be my fuel facility. That's my fleet. Put this mirror in here just to give it that other effect. For right now, but yeah, it's pretty good. Just kind of figuring out where I want stuff at, where it's gonna look good at, and then pull it all back up. Mark it first before I pull it all back up. See if I like it. Still gotta do some weathering. I'll see right here. The engine facility. Gotta do a lot of weathering stuff like that. Bought some just plug lights. I'm gonna put on there. It's pretty good got that going out and then my main will be right here coming around just like I tried to do on my old gauge come back around but this is obviously going to work better bridge will be right here cross over pull back around back up main is probably just going to be one whole loop coming around then again I was thinking about having it come right in here and then build another section of the layout out this way kind of right here where this table's at but wider and have it kind of like a shoelace back and around loop over and under kind of and then come back around through here with a switch back there so you can have another siding going around the back side and back up again but then there will be a grain facility over here that back there will probably be the uh the coal mine facility and then back over here in this corner will be a fuel facility so I mean there's a lot of spots where you can do stuff plenty of room obviously especially with this HO now, O gauge I didn't have very much room because those are so big with this oh yeah plenty of room but looks pretty good Say it again. I've got uh, five engines. All your uh, your two BNS swooshes right here, and then your BNSF heritage back there. The orange ones. They're all all three of those are mine. And then my dad, I ordered him some. He's got the uh, the X War bonnet, the BNSF right here, four seven zero seven. And of course, he's always liked Burlington Northern as well as I have. Grew up with them. He's got the SD70. Well, I believe it's SD60. SD70. Yeah. SD60. <laughs> yeah, SD60. That's a force power train right there. I love it. But this one right here. Ordered it from MTH. That's got all the bells and whistles, LED lights. I mean, it runs freaking smooth. Don't get me wrong, these do too, all these other ones, but 4707, I think I'm going to start ordering from MTH. All these are uh, Walter's main line, and I believe that one's in Athens right back there, the BNSF Heritage. It's got a, it's got an E-Lock sound system on it, a tad from, um, I believe it's from Florida, I believe, in Florida, installed that for me. Pretty good deal, pretty good guy. Very helpful. Help people do things when you help. But yeah, this is the beginning of the yard here. This is going to be Melville. Melville, Texas is what it's going to be. This is just one of the yards. And yeah. Here pretty soon we'll probably have a, another yard back here. So, but I just thought I'd give you all an update. It's been a while. It's probably been like. At least three months. Still going on 
this other stuff right here. So ordering more tracks. So I'm not freighting those down there. But got my plug-ins for my power cabs. NCE power cabs. Um, ordered me a smart booster, 5 amp. Come in handy. And I can just make a link of the uh, NC plugins or the PCP plugins. Yeah. Uh, hope y'all enjoy this video. Thought I'd give y'all an update. Appreciate it. If y'all got any tips or advice or opinions or something that I should do differently on here, just give me a comment or give me a thumbs up. Tell me what you think. Appreciate it.